What is up, guys? Alrighty, trying to make some more content here. After having finished the Blueberry Academy, where we finished off Kieran, we are going to... And by the way, I already went after the first of the ruinous... Ruinous Pokemon, whatever they're called. Um, Wo Chen. I caught Wo Chen successfully. Um, and so after catching Wo Chen, I decided, let me try to film my battles with the other three. So yeah, I did not go after the ruinous Pokemon pre-Elite 4. I decided to save that for after everything else. Um, and yeah. Alrighty, so we are in front of the, uh, Chiyu Shrine. So, uh, Chiyu is a fire and dark fish that can walk on land. Yeah. Cool concept. Cool, um, cool thing, I guess. I don't know. Whatever it might be based off of. I don't know. Um, yeah. Okay. Here we go. So, I think we're all set here. Let me just make sure we are... Let's make sure we're all up to snuff on our HP and PP. Yeah, PP. Um, okay, so let's see. False swipe. Okay, yeah, we're good on that one. Okay, so we need kilowatt roll. Okay. Come on back, Kilowattro. I need you. Kilowattro, you are... Where are you? Okay. Ah. Why are we so far back? Oh, right, because I was looking for Mankey. I was looking to get Mankey and evolve it into Primeape and then Annihilate in order to start doing the 6 and 7 star raids, because apparently that's the only way to really get through the 6 and 7 star raids is to use something like Mankey who has a move that gets increased in power every time it gets hit, which cannot be affected by one of the Terra Pokemon's abilities to negate all of your abilities and stat changes that you made. So, uh, any moves like Stored Power or Rage Fist will uh, be resistant to anything that the Terra Pokemon and the Terra Raid does. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to aim for as one of my next goals with this game. I do think that Kilowattro is here somewhere. I think that I was switching out somebody, so... Hold on. Ay -ay -ay. Ah, no, 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 that's not what I wanted. Okay, wait. Here. Okay. Where is he? Okay, there we go. What box is he in? Ay -ay -ay. This one. Alright, there we go. Okay, so for this battle against Ting Lu, um, I think, probably, yeah, I'll just switch at Arbolita, since Arbolita is weak to fire, okay, and, yeah, okay, let's, alrighty, so, Let's switch in Kilowattro. I make Kilowattro the front. Put him to the front, okay. Right. Okay, so we're in front of the shrine now. All these Pokemon here. Ay ay ay. Chi Yu must uh, garner a lot of uh, popularity amongst Pokemon or something. I don't know. There's a lot of Pokemon in front of this shrine. I don't know. Okay, here we go. A faint sound is coming from within the shrine. Will you touch the shrine? We are touching the shrine. Touch the shrine. Ah! Rumble, 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 rumble. It sounds like somebody's stomach. Okay. Kerbang! Out comes. Looks like a sewer. Gee, you. Splashy! That's the cry that it makes. Splashy. That, that is actually epic. I love that Game Freak did that. That, that is awesome. Five stars, Game Freak. That is amazing. 
<laughs> that is great. Okay. And I mean that actually genuinely. <laughs> okay. Kilowattro, let's do this. Beads of Ruin, weaken the special defense. Okay, special defense weaken. Let's go. T wave right off the bat. Let's do this. All right. Awesome. Ruination. This is like Super Fang. Okay. So that's gonna be. Yeah. It's gonna suck. Okay. Um. Yeah. I hope he doesn't use a fire attack next. Because Ogre Pond is away. Alright, go Ogre Pond! Alright, it's still weak to this move, but not as weak as it is to a fire move, and it's non stab at least. By the way, so the capture card that I had was not compatible with the computer that I have, and that's why I couldn't use it. Hey, you get what you pay for, guys. It just means that I did not buy an expensive enough computer for my next new computer, even though I love my new Asus. It's apparently not expensive enough for the capture card that I got. It's sad that that's how life is sometimes, and we can't just make more computers more compatible with more things. Anyway, after that spiel, let's keep going! And I'm gonna outspeed him to no avail, but... Okay. Okay, we got two paralyzed to move while up in the air. Alright, let's go for false swipe. Alright, that's gonna be a two hit KO, well, a two hit false swipe, almost KO. Or, yeah. Okay, there we go, down to one HP. Swagger, 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 swagger. Do you got that swagger? Do you guys have that swagger? I think I do. I think we should all aim to have more swagger in life. All right, let's go for the Pokeball! Ugh, oh, man. It looked, it, it looked for a second, like... Mm. All right, this is gonna make catching and take a lot longer now. Ay, 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 ay. Imagine if this were to actually work with... <laughs> that would be great if it actually did. Like the game glitched out or something, or whatever. <laughs> no, that would not be good. Alrighty, and oh, oh, yep, cause Swagger, that did a lot of damage. Oh, man. Okay, so we are gonna... Alright, um... Alright, send in this guy here. Let's send in Skeleturge. All right. Two power hacks nice. All right. Here we go. Let's try for another Pokeball. Ah, oh, man. Since we are in a cave, technically, let's try a Dusk Ball. How many I got? Fifteen Dusk Balls. All right. One, two. Ah, oh, man. That was pretty good, though. That was pretty good. All right. Let's go for another dust ball. Go, dust ball! Oh, man. This fire and dark little fish thing that can walk on land and float in the air at the same time is just... Oh, man. This guy is feisty. He's one of the ruinous, he's one of the ruinous four for a reason, I guess. Okay, let's see. Alright. So we have to take the bounce attack. And he got paralyzed up in the air again. Wow. Alrighty, let's go for it. Dust ball! Oh, man! Oh, man. Ruination is a normal type attack, I guess. Okay. I guess so. <sighs> Alright, let's go for another dust ball. Alright. Oh, man. Oh. Alright, let's keep at it. Oh, 
Alright, let's see. What else can we try? Oh man, I meant to go for the quick ball in the beginning. I forgot. Let's see. What else do we have here? Let's try a luxury ball. Let's see. One time I caught a Teraki in back in Black 1 or Black 2. Um, in a luxury ball, yeah. And that was pretty cool that I was able to catch a Teraki on in a luxury ball. Okay. Um, Alright, I know that if you switch between balls, it lowers the chance of it working, but... Oh, man. If you use the same ball consistently, consecutively, I think that it ups the chances from something that I read recently online, but I'm not sure how true that is, but... Alright. Three. Oh my gosh, we did it, we did it, we did it, yes! Yes! In like less than 15 minutes, I think. Alright. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, Chiyu Zeta has been added to the Pokedex. It controls flames burning at over 5,400 degrees Fahrenheit. When it casually swims through the sea of lava, it creates by melting rock and sand. <clears throat> okay, so this is the only other Pokemon than Magmar and Magmortar and Magby that can swim in lava. Nice, alright, 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 cool. Well, yo, so it does swim indeed. And walks on land too because it has to melt the land in order it has to walk on the land in order to melt it right okay sounds good you have a nickname no all right that was awesome we are gonna let's look at the summary the summary is all right so we've got a naughty nature that means high attack and lower special defense okay but it's really a special attacking pokemon yeah that's not the nature that you want all right so, here we go. Chihu has been sent to your boxes. Alright, guys. So, if you enjoyed that, then um, I will be happy to see you watch my next uh, battle with... Um, I think I'm going after Chien Pao next, and then Ting Lu. Yep. Alright, guys. So, have a great day. Stay strong, stay faithful, and be epic.